Hi there, I'm Alex Cunningham, and I'll walk you through this Notion tutorial step by step. Let's jump right in. If you've ever looked at your Notion calendar and felt a bit overwhelmed by a sea of events all blending together, this tutorial is for you. Today, I'll show you exactly how to color code your Notion calendar using tags, so you can organize your schedule at a glance and instantly spot what's most important. By the end of this video, you'll be able to turn your Notion calendar from cluttered and confusing to clear, colorful, and incredibly useful. Let's jump right in. First things first, let's create a database that we can use for color coding. In Notion, a database is just a fancy word for a table or list that holds your information. So go ahead and add a new database to your workspace. You can do this by typing database and selecting the format you like, such as table or list. Don't stress too much about the type for now because the important part is what's inside. Once your database is ready, we need a way to tag and color code individual entries. That's where multi-select properties come in. Think of multi-select as sticky notes that can be attached to each calendar event, each with their own color. In your database, click plus add a property, choose multi-select and give it a clear name like tags. This property will let you attach one or more labels to any event, which is super handy if an event falls into multiple categories. Now for the fun part, let's add some tag values. Click into the tags property for an event and start typing in a word that represents a category, like work, personal, deadline, or even birthday. Each new tag you create will also generate a new color, making it easy to tell things apart. Go through your list and add as many tags as make sense for your schedule. If you ever need to adjust the colors, just click on the tag and choose a shade that visually stands out to you. This is a great time to think about which colors mean what to you. Maybe red for urgent tasks, blue for creative projects, green for meetings, and so on. Next, let's make sure we can see these events on a calendar. To do this, you need to add a date property. From your database, add another property, select date, and name it something like event date or just date. Now, fill in the date for each event so they'll show up on your calendar. Don't worry if this takes a moment. Once you've done it, you'll have all your events ready to be visualized. With your dates added, you'll want to change the way you're viewing your data. Click Add a View, select Calendar, and give your new view a name like calendar view. This will instantly transform your list of events into a calendar format, making it easy to spot when things are happening. To really make those colored tags shine, let's tweak the calendar settings. Open up your calendar view, then click on calendar properties. Find the property visibility section and make sure your tags multi-select property is set to show. This step is key. Otherwise, all your color coding won't be visible right there on the calendar. Now comes the satisfying part. When you look at your calendar, you'll see each event is color-coded by its tag. That means you can instantly pick out, say, which days are packed with work events or when your next birthday is coming up. It's a simple change, but it can really transform how you use your Notion calendar. If you ever add new tags, they'll be color-coded automatically so your system always stays organized. And that's it. You've just learned how to color-code your Notion calendar using tags, making your schedule truly your own. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like the video drop your questions, or share how you're using color coding in the comments, and subscribe to the channel for more Notion tips and tutorials. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.